Torres. What's up, bull? La 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 for your patience. Thank you guys for loving on me. Thank you guys for the continuously uh, continuous support. Thank you guys so much from the most humblest space ever. Thank you, Taurus. All right. Hey, Blue Hair, if this first time to my channel, I'm Mocha. Also, if this first time to my channel, look out. I cuss, okay? May cuss a little, may cuss a lot, just depending on what the hell these cards say. Oh, but I'm a cuss. All right. That's on period. So if cussing don't work for you, please feel free right there now to go find another damn reader here on YouTube that can further assist you without cussing. Because me, this is my shit. We're going to do that. All right. Thank you again for the likes, the shares, the subscribes, the comments, the love, you guys, the emails, you guys, the, the, the continuous pouring into me that you do. Thank you so much from the most humblest space ever. All right. Also, if you're new to the family, <laughs> hey, boo, hey, we're a little dysfunctional over here. Okay. <laughs> we don't fight and fuss, though. We leave that shit on other people's channel. Okay. Shit. But we do cuss. We grow. We love. We evolve. Positive vibes only. Positive type teams. We are family, all right? This message is going to be a timeless reading for the sign of Taurus. Just a little, you know, little razzle-dazzle energy check-in. See what the fuck y'all got going on, all right? If you need a personal reading, that information will be found in the description box below, okay? If you are um, if you are following me on Instagram, y'all, they... <laughs> You've been following me on Instagram, getting that damn weekly tea over there. If you are not, what the hell are you doing? At mocha underscore, underscore love underscore tarot, okay? Um... But they 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 cancel my fucking IGTV over there. <laughs> I don't know what I did to them people, but they 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 cancel my shit. So we we getting ready to start going live after I actually get updated with YouTube as far as the collective readings. Okay, so y'all just work with me, work with me, work for you. Okay, and and let's get this done, get her done. Okay, Taurus, that get her done may be of significance. All right, but this will be for Sun Moon Rising Venus as well as the Cross Watchers, um, as well as the North Node, and anywhere where it is that th this message applies for you. Okay, where you have Taurus in your damn placements in your chart, all of that. Well, I don't even know if I said it right. Fuck it. All right, fuck it. Just do that shit, Taurus. Message. Fuck it. Just do that shit. Don't worry about what you ain't had, what you don't have, what you don't have enough of. Don't worry about what you can't see right now. Just begin to take the steps, my baby, okay? Progress is a process. Don't be so overly self-critical because for some of y'all, you're being overly fucking self-critical, okay? I'm hearing something regarding body consciousness, okay? Excuse me, body consciousness or some type of like, or this could also be the ascension within your consciousness and awareness. But I am hearing something about body dysmorphia, okay, or dysmorphia, body consciousness, something regarding self-love and body positivity, okay. So some of you guys could be working on some type of like advocacy um, or, or, or motivational platform, okay. I'm also hearing seminars, workshops, either you are attending those or you're coordinating those, okay. I am picking up on really good energy with that, Taurus, as we get into the second week of December, all right. I'm hearing something happening to do with divination conjuring metaphysical a lot of you all have been doing a lot of damn digging deep and you seek digging deep you seeking and you are finding taurus okay also message do not go through nobody's motherfucking phone taurus somebody could have went through your phone and this motherfucker ain't gonna bust a grape in welch's backyard you hear what i'm saying do not go through somebody's phone if you're not going to do shit Okay, some of y'all is pain freaking. Okay, or this could be somebody with the as it pertains to you, pain freaking. Someone's looking for a reason to cause chaos. I'm also picking up on this energy of some of y'all are noticing that you're in relationships, partnerships, business relationships, entanglements with people who are addicted to chaos. Someone needs validation, and it don't matter. It doesn't matter how the fuck they gotta get it. You get what I'm saying? I'm also hearing 444 could be of significance, angelic protection, okay? Stability, security, that is the motherfucking focus, that's the motive, all right? I'm also hearing something regarding contractual agreements, all right? Or re-signing some type of lease. For some of you all, if you're re-signing some type of like lease uh, for a location for your business, I am hearing if you can delay that, delay that, because I am hearing the second week of December into the third week, you're going to get a better offer, or you're going to get a better deal, okay? You're going to save some shmoney, you dig? I'm also picking up on partnerships, contractual agreements. They're taking me back there. If you are in some type of like partnership, if you're in a relationship, especially if this is a friend or an ex-lover, spirit is wanting to caution you to create or, or, or like 
have some type of contractual agreement to cover your ass in the long run in place, okay? Because someone's intentions is to be fucking tied to you by any means necessary, especially if this is having to do with love. But this person has a vengeful heart. And I'm picking up on, for some of you all, I'm hearing small occurrences. So there could be like small occurrences or spirit is showing you in your face is undeniable this person's red purple green blue ass fucking flags okay spirit is saying listen listen or or seeing something clearly seeing something with new eyes seeing something clearly something that you can no longer choose not to see or ignore as it pertains to someone's mannerisms some of y'all are being cautioned to separate from something or someone or some type of uh, facility or group association before this person or this affiliate or whatever this is fucks up the fucking church's money, okay? Somebody's getting ready to, or, or someone's intentionally trying to fuck up your brand or assassinate your character or public publicly humiliate you. I'm also hearing scapegoat. Someone could have been used as a scapegoat. I'm also hearing something regarding initiation rituals. Okay, so this could be something on a global scale. You could also be someone in the public eye. Some of you are also, I got leaves falling everywhere around me. I am picking up on something again, falling away, something being eclipsed out, something falling away. I'm also hearing surrendering to the divine in order to co-create with spirit. It's like spirit is working on your behalf. I'm also hearing atheists, okay? So somebody could be on the damn fence as it pertains to their religious and or their religious or their spiritual beliefs. I'm also hearing ascending within consciousness, okay? This could also be uh, involved in some type of like kundalini rising or some type of light body activation, Taurus. A lot of focus around the metaphysical. Some of you all could be starting some type of like a uh, metaphysical jewelry boutique online. Bitch, shoot me that motherfucking link, bitch. I'm also hearing promotion, sponsorship. Some of you all have hidden blessings or there's hidden blessings in connecting with strangers, especially if this is involving some type of like travel. I'm also hearing, okay, so I'm also hearing hidden paternity, hidden, hidden. Someone could also, somebody, someone could be an adult and finding out that their mother didn't tell them the truth about paternity or something was hidden regarding like some type of like family secret regarding incest of some sort, or this could also be like sexual assault. Shit, Taurus. A lot of processing, a lot of acknowledging, a lot of resolutions, a lot of healing, shadow work being done. I'm also picking up on something, again, body positivity. So some of you all could be fitness trainers, okay? I'm also hearing something having to do with like a, a holistic, holistic practitioner or a holistic nutritionist. Mobile chef. I'm hearing DoorDash, Uber, somebody's, again, playing fucking with the church's motherfucking money. Be cool, Taurus. You're gonna get your money, okay? Taurus don't play about they fucking bitch. They Taurus don't play about they food. They 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 nigga or they or they bitch and they fucking money. They don't do that, okay? That's the three ways to get your ass whooped, okay? And they kids, four. I'm also hearing something having to do with children, okay? So some of y'all could be dealing with a child that could be suffering from like multiple personality disorder, okay? I'm also hearing influence, drug influence. Some of y'all need to check under your children's bed. I'm also hearing behind some type of poster. Somebody's child, this could be a young adult child. This child could be uh, freshly in college is what I'm hearing. You may have noticed a difference with your children, but I am hearing downers, okay? So I am hearing... Um, I'm hearing Nick, Nicki Minaj. Um, so some of y'all, this could be a Sagittarius child. I'm also hearing this could also be a Piscean child. A Capricorn child. Scorpio. I'm hearing um, pills and potions. We're overdosing. It's crazy, but I still love you. Okay, so pills and potions, pills, pills and potions. This could also be you tapping into something while you're under the influence, okay? I'm also hearing if you're going to overindulge, some of y'all could be dealing with a Pisces, okay? A Pisces or a Virgo, <clears throat> their sister sign. But I'm strongly hearing that if you're going to tap into, if you're going to overindulge, I'm hearing creative writing or automatic writing. Some of y'all may actually reveal something that you've been stressing over to your damn self if you automatic write. I'm also hearing co-creating with spirit, co-creating with the element earth. This could also have to do with some type of earth magic, earth divination. Some of y'all are teachers of divination. You're holistic practitioners, you're teachers. I'm also hearing shaman, voodoo priestess, okay? 
Some of you all could be teaching a course on something regarding the shadow work or the shadow self, okay, or the shadow elements of a person's um, spirit or soul's journey. I keep hearing contractual agreements. Some of y'all could be working, some of y'all could work with the hands for my Taurus men. You could work in the field of um, either like um, contracting or welding or doing something with your hands. I'm also hearing something regarding a mechanic shop or a mobile mechanic, okay? Marketing. Some of y'all are really needing to get in tune with the, uh, with the different elements or maybe connect with another person because I'm hearing be open to receive help, Taurus. I'm also hearing delegate your task. I heard you can't buy nothing with pride. Some of y'all are being very prideful. Like, people are asking you, do you need my help? You're like, no, I got it. No, bitch, you don't. <laughs> you don't. You don't got it, okay? Be open to receiving. And that's usually not y'all energy. Y'all are really, y'all are naturally, like, for the most part, some of y'all are really open to receiving help. Well, my Taurus women, okay? Taurus men, you're going to need help with executing something, okay? You may be getting help possibly from a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or another earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, okay? I heard watch the air sign, watch the water sign. Someone wants to benefit, but they don't want to do no motherfucking work. I'm also picking up on, some of y'all is dealing with a very nagging individual. I feel like someone purposely tries to like be a, like a distraction or purposely try to delay you. I am picking up on some of you all are being called to reassess your boundaries. I am hearing maternal figure. This could be a parent. Uh, this could be a parent. This could also be someone judging your beliefs. I'm literally seeing somebody watching Tarot with the phone face down, okay? Some of y'all could be tapping very heavily into your ancestry or your ancestral gifts. I'm also hearing the inheritance of ancestral gifts. I'm hearing prophetic dreams, lucid dreams. Somebody could also be, um, okay, I'm hearing DMT. Hallucinogens, hallucinations. I'm also hearing something. Someone's being in denial about their child needing, like, someone's in denial. This don't feel like you, Taurus. This could be, like, somebody who you're attached to. Like, I'm hearing demonic possession. Somebody is in two minds regarding their children being, like, evil as fuck, okay? I'm also hearing authenticity, originality. I'm also hearing sensuality. For some of you all, you may want to do some type of like abstract art. I'm hearing mirage, okay? I'm also hearing, um, okay, so this could also be canvases. Some of you all may want to sell your art or you're looking for ways to actually like promote your artistry. Whether this is music, I'm literally seeing art, okay? Someone does abstract art. I'm also seeing some of y'all, you could also meet like meet weekly or meet monthly in some type of group setting okay to do some type of like abstract art i'm literally hearing some of you all are wanting to or you needing to do a lot of research or do research as it pertains to connecting with a third party entity whether this is amazon whether this is a third party entity in order to um distribute your products or distrib distribute okay assist you with with the distribution of your of your art some of you all are selling yourself short you're being called to like really align with a higher vision, okay? Higher purpose, a lot of focus on purpose and really the mastery of your gifts. I'm hearing clear audience. See, bitch, you're not crazy. You clear audience. You hearing shit, okay? Some of you all also, there's a focus on trusting your intuition and not doubting or not like being skeptical. Okay, so I'm hearing mediumship. So this could even be like, skepticism around the um and some of y'all could have scorpio on your chart okay but this could be like some type of mediumship or being skeptical regarding the spirits in which you're entertaining on the other side okay i'm hearing trickster spirit some of you all you may have a spirit that is like you may have a spirit that is um i'm also hearing shapeshifter either some of y'all got somebody actually stalking you or actually infiltrating your motherfucking space a shapeshifter okay air sign gemini libra aquarius Taurus, this is some of y'all doing this to a fucking air sign. Someone is like really like somebody's really somebody's a habitual boundary fucking stepper. I'm hearing this person being binded within the astral realm or binded within the spiritual. Someone could have been trying to like trap your spirit in the astral realm. Bitch, what? 
Some of y'all could also be fighting with someone in the astral realm. Listen, I told y'all, told the fire signs, the Mocha is in tune with her shadows and her light. Bitches in your dreams, and you know you don't fuck with them. They don't fuck with you. Choke that hoe. You hear what I'm? Choke. 1-800, choke that hoe. You get What the fuck are you here for? Nobody invited you here. What are you doing? I'm picking up on someone trying to... This could be someone in the same field as you, especially if you are a spiritualist, again, or a holistic practitioner or a practitioner of any kind. I'm hearing energy healing. Some of you all could have recently went and got some type of like energy clearing or you're looking for someone in order to do that. Some of y'all could be looking for a shaman to connect with. I'm also hearing the releasing of the releasing of like or cutting the cord from. OK, so cutting. OK, so some of you all, you're realizing that you're having to cut the cord from some type of like maternal trauma or some type of trauma that follows your maternal, your maternal line or something that happens within your mother's side of the family. I am hearing something regarding sexual assault, y'all. So. I don't mean to trigger anybody, but I am picking up on something having to do with rape advocacy. It's like your greatest trauma is your motherfucking biggest success. Some of y'all are having to learn how to transmute energy. You could have mutable energy in your chart, Sagittarius, Virgo, Pisces, Gemini, or be dealing with one, okay? I feel like someone was sent in your life to be an earth angel or you to another individual, but I am hearing it's a time for, it's, it's a time for you to accept reasons and seasons. Like someone gave you the answer key. Also... Some of you all could be connecting with a situation or some of you all, I'm hearing, <coughs> baby, this fucking instant, these instants ain't fucking playing with me. I'm hearing, okay, I'm hearing, um, look at your photograph, it kind of made me laugh, look at that. Back down memory lane. Some of y'all are taking a trip down, back down memory lane. Someone feels as if they miss an opportunity or they... Or they forfeited their blessings, they forfeited their path, they forfeited their 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 they forfeited their chances of growing something or expanding something with you, or you this you feel this to another person. Some of you all some okay, so some of y'all I'm hearing some of y'all could have denied someone because they were going through an awakening. And now that you're in this space of going through this awakening, the only person that you feel like you could talk to is this person. However, someone's afraid of being rejected or someone doesn't want to be like shut down or embarrassed or talk too crazy or some shit. So they just sit back and watch. Someone feels that you're beautiful, Taurus. Some of you guys could also be getting very heavily into like photographs, videography, modeling, okay? I'm also hearing designer, designer prints. Some of you all could be clothing designers. I'm seeing something regarding shoes specifically. Shoes, hoodies, customization, customizing, or customizing clothes. Again, I'm also hearing some of y'all could be doing research on like God, like the various types of gods or deities, okay? Or this could be uh, you coming into realization of what Luau has your head. I'm picking up on somebody being very like, Somebody battling with themselves or someone battling their own demons as it pertains to addictions, okay, and overspending. I feel like some of you all are realizing how much money either someone that your partner wins, either someone that your partner with partnered with spends on bullshit or you, okay? I'm hearing emotional spending. Also, if you're connecting with someone that who's incarcerated, some of y'all may be finding out that somebody is talking to like multiple people in order to survive and thrive in jail, bitch. Listen, when I'm alone in my room, sometimes I stay at the wild, bitch, the fucking, them fucking jailhouse pen pal letters be every fucking thing until you find out that this bitch is still a cheater. Bitch, every time, what, what, what was that, uh, what was that video on TikTok? I ain't ride. I don't want to be no ride or die. Every time I ride, I didn't ride. I didn't roll and I died. I didn't ride and I, I ride and I die. Okay. Some of y'all is tired of being, I'm, not, I'm no longer being a ride or die. Bitch, you costing me too much money. A lot of focus on fitness, detox teas. I'm hearing Keisha Kaor. Somebody could have recently ordered or looked at Keisha Kaor tea. I'm also picking up on, um, okay, I'm, I heard beautician. Okay. You could also be. Somebody's a beautician. Someone does hair. You are you have ordained hands. You have your hands have been like ordained to heal. This was prophesied over you when you were younger. For some of you all, I'm hearing charge your worth. Charge your worth. Fuck a friend. Charge your worth. Okay. 
Okay, so I'm hearing fuck love. I'm over it, all right? So for some of y'all, you could be feeling as if you're over love. That's going to change. I am hearing something regarding things being cleared out, eclipsed out in order to in order to align you with your blessing or get you realigned with your path, okay? Because I am hearing something regarding um, February. Some of y'all could be literally dealing with an Aquarius or you're meeting an Aquarius around the beginning of the year, okay? By the springtime, for those of you who are single, you're going to be fucking booed up. Again, the reassessment of your boundaries. Really, really weighing up the fucking pros and cons in the past. And it's kind of like some of you all are afraid to trust in the present due to a lot of betrayal in the past, which ultimately is really like stagnating your future because for some of you all i'm hearing faded meetings it's faded for you to meet someone if you are being like if you are being invited to invite if you are being invited to some type of event or some type of formal event okay i see somebody picking up a green dress beautiful green this is pretty i'm also hearing event coordinator event coordination okay some of you all are really focused on your career at this time, and that's a good look for you, Taurus. Again, I'm hearing focus on your focus, okay? I was going to pull some cards for y'all, but I don't have all of my damn supplies. This was just kind of done on the humble because it's like y'all were screaming at me. And I heard some of y'all talking shit like, bitch, you ain't done Taurus. And a bitch, 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 this my shit. Don't be telling me. I know what the fuck I ain't done. Just like you know. Some of you all, this could literally be someone who you have children with, or this could even be like some type of family interference. I'm hearing mother-in-law. Somebody's mother-in-law don't know how to mind a fucking business. And whoever this is, they create, they, they, they create broken people. <laughs> Ain't nobody in the family got their shit together. Let me pull a few cards for y'all in love. Let me see. For those who are wanting to hear about love, what's going on with Taurus? Oh, I got you, Michael, Gabriel, Uriel. Let us try and let Hesiah please come forth and allow me to be the vessel of love, light, divine wisdom, and truth for the sign of Taurus. Show me what it is that they're needing to know at this time so that they can become the highest versions, the best versions of themselves in their journey. What's going on with love? Baby Boat. Receiving what you need, progression, uh, progression, arriving, moving on, closure issues, okay? So somebody's holding on to some shit. If you're waiting for some type of closure or you're waiting to hear from somebody before you completely move on, for some of you all, I'm literally hearing social media. Some of y'all may find out something on social media. Some of y'all also may find out why someone ghosted you or you or someone's finding this out about your ass, okay? You guys got camera. Reminisce, reminiscing, bitch, I'm good. Reminiscing, keepsake, perception, learn from the past, make memories, okay? Some of you all, I am hearing, Spirit is really working on you to help you stay in the present. Because for some of you all, the past is hurtful or the past is traumatic and the future is a bit fucking stressful. Some of y'all so damn focused on the future. Some of y'all watching too many fucking tarot readings, okay? Paradise, happiness, expansion, joy, playfulness, oneness, enjoying each other soulmates okay so for those of you who are experiencing new love all right if you completely like cut off somebody and somebody's coming in to be a disturbance the reason why this person is coming in to be a disturbance because this person already know whoever it is that you're connecting with some of y'all is going into a seven-year cycle with somebody okay happiness expansion joy playfulness oneness enjoying each other somebody could also be inviting like you on some type of trip someone wants to like break Someone wants to, like, cancel tradition completely. Like, bitch, I know we usually be over at ain't fucking Jackie House, ain't Sally Nim, you know, but fuck that this year, bitch. We going to fucking Jamaica, bitch. We going to go shake ass on the boat. Soulmates. Soul connection, partnership, agreement, soul contract, okay? So for some of y'all, this have to do with, like, some type of, um connection or some type of um current connection that you're in also expanding or, like, say, for instance, if you're dating someone, some of y'all could be moving in with someone, I'm talking long-term commitment, okay? I'm also hearing vows. Someone could also be wanting to um, propose to someone who they have children with. Okay? So let's get into it. Spirit, give me some advice for my Tauruses. I didn't realize that I had sat here and channel for like 20 minutes. Give me some advice <laughs> for my Tauruses. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. The cross watchers, I feel y'all. Before I even upload this, I feel y'all in the building towards people be mad at y'all asses for years, bitch. What y'all be doing to people? I ask, like, I'm gonna ask y'all like I asked Gemini. Is it a, is it a spin? Is it a like, do you do you prop down on the D or is it a, is it a like a little slight spin around? How do you do it? 
I'm trying to be like a tourist when I grow up. The fuck? Let me see. Give me some advice <laughs> for my Tauruses. Empathy. I'm open to seeing both sides of a situation, okay? So for some of you all, it's okay to be empathetic for someone. It's okay to like be sympathetic, empathetic towards someone's situation, but not to your own damn detriment and demise. Some of y'all done rolled and died. Rolled and died. And some of y'all is realizing it's okay to love somebody from a motherfucking distance. Healthy boundaries towards, okay? I'm also hearing love on yourself. Put that same energy into self. Really connecting with that yin energy. I'm hearing something regarding... um face masks, face masks, um, tea, ba tea baths, like, I'm hearing green tea, green tea bath, green tea bath, some of y'all could also be, um, doing some type of, or, or changing up your, changing up your skin care regime, some of y'all could also make holistic, uh, com cosmetic products as well, purpose, bitch, I know what I'm here to do, the focus is your focus, Taurus, Really focus because spirit is really aligning you all with your purpose. For some of you all, you're spiritualists. You are empaths. You are spiritual teachers, okay? Ain't nothing to it but to do it. Less fucking fear, more faith. More faith, less fear. All right? It's like you know what you want to do, but now it's time to actually put the fucking work in. And for some of you all, there's like this tea to tide. Tea to tide. Spirit is saying, listen, big 222 energy. Let's balance that thing all night, all right? Some of y'all could be dealing with the Leo as well. Okay, give me one more advice because that was pretty much still some damn guidance. Let me give some advice. Advice for Taurus. Transformation. Respect your transformation. You are ascending during this time, Taurus. Y'all, I'm so sorry. I've been fucking getting in my fucking car together and I decided to fucking come with Taurus. I also, also, somebody needs to clean their damn car and your environmental space could be affecting your energetic field, okay, or your auric field. Some of y'all, if you could, if you could, if you put somebody out, put they shit out too, and all of the shit that they gave you the whole damn nine, don't half ass it, okay? Transformation. Visualize, affirm, manifest that shit, Taurus. Focus on the focus, Taurus. It's winning season. It's your time. You're being pushed spiritually beyond your limitations in order for you to face your fears, in order for you to create new memories and create new moments. Expand your brands, honey. Walking your purpose. All right? So y'all let me know how the hell that resonates. I'm surprised I did a damn Taurus reading this motherfucking Because y'all know. I'm just I'm hoping y'all surprise me this time. I, I'm hopeful, Taurus. I'm really optimistic. Okay? But you guys, again, if you need a personal reading, all right, feel free to, um, you can email me at mocha, M-O-C-H-A-D-E-L-O-V-E at gmail.com. For the month of November, I'm doing old prices on, bitch, on December 1st. That will change, okay? Um, but 30 minutes is for $65, 45 minutes is $80, and 60 minutes is 100 okay, for now. Okay, so I love y'all a long time. I pray that this message finds you in love, divine wisdom, and truth, honey, and I will see y'all next time. Baboos.